Hello, my loves. I hope you guys are doing well. Welcome to this video for how to find your planetary signs. We are going to be using a website called cafeastrology.com. And we are going to be entering in our birth time, date, and location. If you do not happen to know your birth time, please click the video link that's popping up right now or the one in the description to take you to the video for how to douse and find out your birth time. So we are going to be going to the direct link for the free natal birth chart on cafeastrology.com, but you can also just go to cafeastrology.com and click through the links for the natal birth chart. But for simplicity here, we're going to be typing in the direct link. So you'll see I typed in astro, A-S-T-R-O dot cafe astrology, C-A-F-E-A-S-T-R-O-L-O-G-Y dot com forward slash natal, N-A-T-A-L dot P-H-P. We're going to hit enter here. So right here is the birth chart information, and we're going to be entering in the details of our birth. I'm just going to be adding fake information here. This is not my actual information. So you see I entered my name here, I picked a pronoun, entered the date of birth here, the end birth time here. And down here, you're going to start typing in your city. And you'll notice a drop down menu starting to form. So here's the drop down menu, you want to select your city and state. And you see the drop down menu still there, but the information was selected. This is difficult to use this form on a mobile app. So I do recommend using a desktop so that you don't run into any compatibility issues. Once you've selected the right birthplace, you come down here to the submit button and click. So this is going to be all of the information for your birth. You can double check that you put in the right data here. And so here's the chart that we're really looking for right here. You can right click on it and save this chart. Okay, so you'll notice here each one has a symbol and then the sign is also written out here. So we're going to go through the Sun, Moon, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, Pluto. You don't need to know Lilith or the North Node for the readings that we'll be doing. You will also want to know your ascending sign. Now, in the case that you are watching the monthly readings, if you're subscribed to that service with me, you if you don't have a planet in the sun, that sign that we're reading for, you'll just go to the reading that's void in whatever sign that we're doing. So there will be still a reading for you, even if you don't happen to have a planet in the current sun sign that we're focusing on. You can also, I do recommend also scrolling all the way down here to the bottom of this really detailed description. And I do recommend reading it when you have the time. It's some great information here to help you understand a little bit more about your energy and the influences on it. All the way down here at the chart, the bottom, you're gonna to get to a place that says your personal natal chart. I recommend clicking enlarge this chart. Gives you more details here. And then you can right click again, save image. And here we go. So you can also see here, there's a short list of all of your planets and the signs is in. They're not spelled out for you, so you would have to know which one of these signs is applicable for each sign, which symbol is applicable for each sign. And if you don't know that, you can always look it up, but I will be sharing what sun sign we are in and what the symbol for that is with all of the readings that I do. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial video, and I look forward to seeing you in your monthly readings if you're part of that service. Thank you so much and namaste. The universal light within me salutes and honors the universal light within you. 
Namaste.